Okay, this is what God wants me to share with you today, and this is really um, different for me. Um, I heard, oh, let's see, how do I start this? Um, well, did, did you know that it's none of your business if someone else is sinning? That it's none of your business if someone else is teaching a wrong doctrine? That you are responsible for your relationship with Jesus Christ. That you're responsible only for how you respond to other people treating you good or bad. How you obey the Holy Spirit. And how you do what you're told to do by the Holy Spirit. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> it's the Holy Spirit's responsibility to convict the world and everybody of their sin. It's the Holy Spirit's job to teach people to correct, and it's the Word's job and the anointing's job to correct people. So you are stepping out of your place when you point out different <clears throat> people, denominations, groups, or whatever, and you say you're a watch person or whatever, and you say this person's sinning, this person's doing this, um, this group is wrong in their doctrine. You're sinning when you do that because that's not your job. And who are you to judge another man's servant? And these people are God's servants. This is really, this is rough, but this is what God said to share with you today. Um, these people are other, are God's servants, not yours. So they can say and do what they want and they have to answer to God for that. But you have to answer to God for what you say and do and think. And your only responsibility is to answer to your boss, to your father, and that's God. And not, um, your job is not to correct other people, unless the Holy Spirit is directing you as a Sunday school teacher to teach the class that, um, and to correct, edify them in love. But, um... That's what God wants me to share with you, that you're, it's none of your business how somebody treats you. <clears throat> if you're married and your spouse is saying, you know, saying, oh, do this, do that, and you're saying, but you don't understand, I don't want to do this, I don't want to do that, or blah, 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 whatever. I'm not talking about physical abuse, but it's none of your business to say, but God, they're wrong because they said this. Your business is to answer to God. And so, that's my um, thing that God wants me to share with you today, and there must be somebody out there, so I'm going to pray for you real quick. Father, I just pray for whoever, whoever watches this videotape, whoever needs to hear this, whoever this was for, Father, that they would have ears to hear and eyes to see, that they would be open to the correction of the Holy Spirit so that they can be in a place <clears throat> to receive all that you have for them. They would be in a place to receive your um, prosperity, in a place to receive your health and your wholeness and your fullness of the Holy Spirit. That they would be in a place to hear your voice because they are obedient to you, Father. And they repent of any sin in their life. And Father, I thank you that you just do work in all my friends and contacts and sub subs. Father, that you just bless them. Father, and most of all, that you reveal yourself to them, make yourself real to them, Father, that they can have and know you personally. In Jesus' name, amen. And my name is Robin Bremer, and you're watching Walks with God.